Welcome to another episode of Grubmaster's Triple T. Today we're discussing lid stands. Carl, what is a lid stand? And why do you have so many of them? Well, let's start with the purpose of a lid stand. The lid stand is so that when you're using your Dutch oven and you're cooking and you've got a bed of coals on top of your Dutch oven lid and you're going to add contents or maybe you've got to stir or check on it, it gives you some place to put your Dutch oven lid without sticking it in the dirt or on a pile of leaves yeah. and getting all that inside your food. Not a good idea. So that's the purpose of a lid stand. I want to keep the inside of that lid nice and clean. The reality is a lot of it comes down to personal preference. What do you like? What's your appetite for cost? Some of these wire ones are pretty inexpensive. Yep. Um, these are nice, it's the lodge one because it folds up. It's nice that it folds up. Sometimes it's not so nice that it folds up because yep. it takes and it falls over on you. Not good. Um, whereas one of these, they seem to uh, stand out in the crowd when you are uh, got leaves on the ground and everything versus this dark one, so they work pretty well. Uh, so a couple different types. You also look to a lot of people who want to store their equipment inside their Dutch oven. Ah. So they want to see that it fits inside of their Dutch oven. I notice sometimes when you're baking, you actually put a lid stand inside your Dutch oven. Is that not right? Yeah, to use it as a trivet. Yep. These are kind of high, uh, so it would create a lot of space, so you want to be able to have something as deep, perhaps, in your Dutch oven. But yeah, they work for that as well. Nice. One of the other things that makes these very useful is to take a lid stand, put it upside down, have coals on top of the lid stand, take your lid, put your lid on top of the lid stand like that. I have it upside down so that it clears the loop on top of the Dutch oven lid, and now you have a frying pan. Ah, smart, smart. So that's another use uh, for a lid stand uh, in, in baking. Some Dutch ovens come that don't have legs on the bottom, like this one, and people will put their Dutch oven without legs right on top of that to create that airspace for the coals. Multifunctional. Multifunctional. Lately, there's a couple other gadgets that have come out that act as lid stands as well. This is the Camp Made one. It has a spring here, and what it does is it takes and clamps down on top of your lid, and you can put it on the, uh, on the ground, and you're not in the dirt. So Good. that's one. It has some other purposes that you can research and take a look at. And then Camp Chef has another gadget that they came out with that takes and turns, it's like a T. It has this loop, this uh, bracket here that goes through the loop of the lid stand. And this too will lift up your lid and be able to keep it above the ground. And allows you to have a food, a nice Dutch oven meal without a bunch of compost in it. Smart ideas. One of the other things that we have done in a pinch or just out of uh, convenience is take our Dutch oven lid and put it on our chimney that we're using. Make right. it a little hot, you don't want to leave it there for a long time, but chances are you've got a chimney, charcoal chimney, right near where you're working. Right. Um, why not take advantage of it? One less thing to carry around, and you already got it right next to your you fire. You already have it right next, and it keeps your lid warm. Smart. I hope you really enjoy these tips and tools, and uh, catch us on another episode. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Welcome to another episode of Grubmasters Triple T. Today, we're discussing lid holders. Also known as lid stands. I, right, just making sure he knew. Hey, let's do it again. Six, three, 